what's up everybody and welcome back to the channel and we're gonna have a good video today we had brought out the national firearms 130 year old 12 gauge i only shot this thing once before to see how it does to make sure it didn't blow up into my face uh i mean i'm telling you it's an old gun sometimes it works right and sometimes it don't but i'm going to show you today the national firearms i think uh who bought national? marlin marlin bought national firearms over uh it's kind of a, a weird setup I mean, it's pretty cool though but sometimes it has a failure to eject and it does have a hammer on it uh it's pretty cool then you got the uh, little button on the side right here you know what i mean you push it before you can get the slide down then you got to make sure when you do that you got to make sure your hand is out of the way because when that slide goes back if you got your hand like this in this position that slide will come back and pinch your fingers underneath that trigger i mean it's kind of a old setup but uh it works it does the job aims good uh, it's a long gun, a real, real long gun. But, uh, yeah, we had fun blowing it up. When we got this gun, uh, it wasn't too long ago, I re -blued it. And somebody who ever had it before me had black spray paint on it, like layer after layer after layer. I mean, it was it was something else. So we ended up having to sand it down, re blew it and everything. But inside was all gummed up i think that's where our failure to eject is sometimes because the uh the loading ramp on the bottom don't want to push the next round up or when it does it locks up the next round where it don't want to go <laughs> i don't know but yeah let's load this thing up i mean and let's get the shooting at it i'll probably have to load it up one at a time because i don't want to keep having that failure to eject or i can load up the first round that way it goes in real easy so uh, like that and up and you do got that safety that half cock safety so let's get to shooting this and uh, we're going to shoot a pot over here let's do it first round cock it back see if it ejects nope but that's all right. Like I said, we'll load it up one at a time. That ain't no big deal. And the 12 gauge rounds that I'm using, if I didn't already say it, it's the Federal seven and a half shot. Federal seven and a half shot. For all the curious minds out there, let's look at that pot again. It actually shoots actually pretty straight. All right, then there you go again, like I was telling you, when I injected that out, you can see on my finger and my thumb where that ramp, the uh, the gate hit me. I mean, it kind of stings a little bit, but I just gotta remember when I'm going to rack that round out of there, I gotta take my hand out of the way or you're gonna get like Garand bite or something. When you people know, when you load an M1 Grand up, you get that Grand thumb. Well, you get grand thumb when you shoot this damn thing. <laughs> it's nuts. I mean, it's fun to shoot. It won't be my home self-defense gun. Or I probably won't go shooting deer or anything. Well, I might shoot a deer with it. Maybe. I don't know. But like I said, you ain't going to have no follow-up fast shots. So let's shoot this again. What's up with you? <laughs> yeah, unless, yeah, unless a camera Kobe guy is with me and he can do follow-up shots with his 12 gauge. There, I got my hand out of the way. And like that, it's, I think it's the clip there. I, I don't want to eject that out. I got to take it apart and find out why, but it's, it's 130 all 130 right. years old, what do you expect? Yeah, 130 <laughs> years old, it still shoots though. Yeah? Shoots good. Oh, I'm bludgeoned. Oh, shit. <laughs> Let's see what the pattern is. Uh, we're going to shoot that tree this time. I'm going to walk over and show you what the pattern of this is. All right, here we go. Like I said, they're all federal. Seven and a half shot. So let's check it out. Pattern. Yeah. 
if we can see the pattern on it. I can't see. Yeah, you can see a little bit of the pattern right there. It's still a tight little pattern to it. If you can see it, look at right there. Where most of the BBs hit. And there's a BB sticking out of a tree right there. Ain't that cool. But yeah, that is the National Firearm. National Firearms 12 gauge. And I hope you like the video of the old guns. I like shooting old guns. Maybe we'll try to get some more old guns and uh, shoot them later on in the channel too. But man, it's cold out here today. Um, it's hard for me to catch my breath. I want to get the hell out of here. And if you ain't did it yet, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And I am out of here.